Alrighty, today we're going to go ahead and perform a alternator max out test. We have our VAT40 hooked up onto our battery, and we're going to go ahead and have our inductive clamp today on our alternator out. And it's best to go ahead and have our amp clamp on the alt out, but if it's not accessible, then the battery cable will be sufficient. But to get the best reading, you want to go ahead and have that on your alternator out. Now we're going to go ahead and start the engine. We're going to go ahead and uh, take the engine off idle when we perform a alternator max out test. Now we're at our VAF 40. We're going to go ahead and load the alternator until it hits about 12 volts and see what the amperage is. We'll make sure we have our circuit on our charging scale. We're going to go ahead and start this off. Now we're going to load the battery until it's about 12 volts and you can see it's about 40 amps. Now this alternator is a 45 amp max alternator so that's sufficient.